What it do, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, it's your boy, that Philly Chef. Hey, so today we're making sliders. You know, game day, any day, so it's always a good day for some sliders. So we actually, I actually have a, you know, a little house recipe that I'm about to show y'all that we uh, like here in a golfing household. But before we get things started, I'm going to get my hands washed because, you know, cleanliness is next to godliness. And I'm trying to get into the perfect gates anywhere I can. So, um... All right, let's get this thing popping. So over here, I have um, my griddle. My griddle's nice. What, what you doing? Oh, hey, baby girl. I, I was just telling the people, the people here, you know, yeah. my people, the, yeah, about the um, sliders. You mean my sliders? Well, I mean, you know, technically, but you know, I was wanting to show her how to make the sliders. But they're mine still. You know what? I'm, You're fired. I'm doing this now. You know what? I need to wash my hands. So first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna get these buns nice and toasted. So I'm gonna throw them on the grill with a little butter. Just just rip into the back because we're gonna use all the buns anyway. Why do you have to hug my dad like that? Listen, discipline. You know what the Bible says, spare the rods for the child. We're going we gonna spare no bags around here. That thing to be nice. Alright, right, so we're gonna get these buns nice and toasted. Alright. Oh. Oh real rock science to that. Look at that nice and toasted. Alright. And these are some experienced hands, so you know I can just use my hands and because you know this is a family meal, so you can show off on my show. Because you got them little baby hands, you can't get them as hot as you know. Okay. Alright, so I got the bun nice and toasted. Now we'll come back for our burgers. What you doing? Making my meat. Alright, fine. If you don't need me, I don't. I'm just gonna be over here. Hot yeah, Reading my paper. Do it. My crinkly paper. Take it in small amounts and roll it up. I, I can't 
can't hear you. What's that? And roll it up. Roll. Okay. You know, make sure it's a nice circumference of the ball. It's got to be at about 53 and a half angle. That's why I use it. I'm just saying. So why do you add ground pork and ground beef? Most burgers just come with ground beef. Well, that flavor, the texture, and other things. You don't need to know, because I'm the chef here. So all, all the burgers going to be about the same size? No. Each burger is, is its own person. Mm, okay. It's unique, huh? Yes. Okay. Uniquely different. Message! Go ahead and read it. Okay, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, read about the uh, six seat school board seat to District 4. Cool. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, so interesting. Yeah. What you doing? What's in the container? Bacon jam. Bacon what? Bacon jam. Bacon jam over bacon. What's, what's, what's bacon jam? It's bacon with jam. Bacon jam. Okay, okay. So you're going to put that on the burger? Yes. Okay. What kind of cheese are you going to use? I usually use smoked provolone. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I'm using regular provolone. Yeah. Excuse me, sir. You know. Okay. Okay. You know, usually around this time, I get a break. Cool. Yeah. Go take a look then. So, uh, why don't you say, uh, we'll be right back. Okay. We'll be right like back. It's a great little condiment. Uh, basically, it's some sauteed onions, bacon chopped up, a little brown sugar, and it's bacon jam. It's like a jam, but it's made with bacon and onions. It's a great condiment for sliders. So I added that to the bottom of the slider buns. Once the baby girl finishes with the burger, she's gonna put it on top, but not before we get this cheese all uh, ooey and gooey and melted and delicious. Why don't you come over here and tell the people about the sauce? Consists of four things. A bowl, ketchup, ketchup, mayonnaise, mayonnaise, sriracha, sriracha, a little spice in your life, ranch, that's it. That's it. Four ingredients. That's so, a yada sauce. Take a good amount of ketchup. That should be enough. Get my handy dandy spoon. Good job on the burger, by the way. Good job on the bacon jam. So you take a nice amount of mayo. So watch it adds that nice kick of spice. But I don't want to add too much, so it's too spicy. And then ranch. I don't know why I added it. Yes, too. That's it. And we get to mix. And it's 
sauce should look like this. Put this in the refrigerator. Rip this food. All right, so these burgers are just about done. So what I'm going to do is add this smoked provolone cheese. all together. So tear them off into twos because your buns are paired into twos. And we're going to add our smoked provolone cheese. Get all nice and melty. Mm -hmm. Let's talk to people. So it's gonna get melted with the steam that's in the burgers, and since it's on 400, all the heat will melt the cheese. And cheese doesn't have to have a high temperature to be melted easily. So they melt together, and you have some of the toes. So you know, during this whole quarantine day, it's really great as a family to get in the kitchen and just cook. You know, since we can't go out to, you know, our you know favorite restaurant and enjoy a nice slider, you make them at home. Hey, you can have as many as you like, and there's no judgment. All right, so now these burgers are ready to come on. Look at that! Look at that cheese pool. I like the nice cheese pool. I don't know. This is so satisfying to see. Ooh, cheese. Cheese. Uh-oh. We have one left. No, it's going to be okay. Yeah. All right. Since you're home, it doesn't matter as far as the mess. So we're going to let the rest of these cook off real quick. So we have 10 burgers right here. So now we're going to hit it with that yada sauce. Put it on top. special sliders right here with your bacon jam, your toasted bun, your yada sauce, and your smoked pokemon cheese. It doesn't get any better than this, I'm trying to tell you. Unless well, you have some homemade fries. Homemade fries, always a good thing. So let's go ahead, plate these bad boys up. See what we got. Oh, nice cheese bowl. All right, so it's going to be time for a cheese bowl. So satisfying. Break. We'll see you in a minute.
So my slide is half finished. We'll Would make you it, like to top them? Or make it a little fancy little. Yeah. The elbow. The elbow. That's not, that's not. So, okay, my slide is half finished. The nice and delicious looking. It's just fun. All right, so, you know, what time of the show it is. Uh, so like always, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Hey, you know, it says season two is all about family, good conversation, good food. Um, you know, I love to cook, she loves to cook. We love to cook because we love to fill your belly. And, uh, you know, filling your belly fills our heart with joy. So uh, thank you again. So I'm about to grab me one of these sides over here. You do that. And uh, finish reading my paper. Yes, go have fun reading your paper. All right. Bye bye. Have fun time reading. Order up. You're throwing down with that Philly chef.